Hello everyone, it's been a long time hasn't it? Um, hope you're doing well in the lockdown. I've been a little bit creative if you haven't heard. Um, gonna, gonna do a little bit of an update. I've got a podcast out with my friend Rebecca. Uh, it's called Pop and Fizz and in it we discuss movies and we do improv and well I direct the improv and soon we're gonna start doing radio plays which are going to be uh, syndicated on the uh, talk talk with your mouthful podcast with Michael Chan I'm looking forward to that um, so what else what else have we got on um, I well congratulations to me yay I uh, got to 100 uh, columns on tggeeks.com um, thanks to Ben and Keith for putting up with me for 100 episodes and uh, uh, another thing so today's um, we just released the interview with Felicity Tillak who um, who directed the film which I produced well mentored through I mentored uh, the film her film called impossible to imagine which is available in most territories on Vimeo on demand so a few bucks you can see a lovely heartwarming film about love and relationships and business and moving forward and what's going to happen to all of us in the future in Kyoto Japan um, written by a very talented young filmmaker um, the other thing uh, an update on my film Matcha and Vanilla it's got it's had a bit of a I don't know the the lockdown has had an advantages and disadvantages I've had time to sort of look at the film and do some more editing myself uh, the disadvantage means we need to do some dubbing with the audio and um, we can't really proceed with that until people are allowed to really get together so hopefully from now uh, we can do that um, you know Paul's working hard on, on finalizing the film uh, we've made about 12 songs they're, they're almost all mastered uh, one of which was co-written by me which is a dream come true especially um, you probably don't know this because I don't exactly advertise it but as a young kid when I got sick and I, um, my mum was working and I had to stay um, at my father's church sometimes if I was feeling better I'd, I'd hit the loops on the electronic organ and then hit the microphone and sing and record on dad's old Hitachi um, you know radio recorder and um, I would make bad songs but I guess it's always been a little bit of a dream of mine and now it's a reality so hopefully come August not August forget that come October-ish you'll be able to listen and to see what what we've made um, I'm really excited to be able to share it with you it's um, uh, the music's by a guy I'm a huge fan of and everything that Darren did to make the song come together is really a dream come true um, so things are exciting it might seem like they're not moving but they really are so um, if you want to be a guest on my podcast if you want to be interviewed um, by my column please let me know if not say hello and I'll say hello and let's be friends okay bye for now